hope this is not as gross as it looks. It's probably really gross. Hello? That's why I'm mm. not eating it. Who is the milkman? <laughs> just remembered something. I think I, the <laughs> I can't explain it right now. I'm sorry. Oh. Who is this? I think it. Maybe I could try. Okay, now on, your name isn't Boyne. I it's think Boyne. like. I mean, there was something on Sims, you know how they always have like descriptions of the furniture that don't always make sense? Like no. when you have, when you're shopping in Sims, it'll oh, be like in the Sims, refrigerator yeah. and have like a funny description of it. Yeah, yeah. I remember one time one of them was for a toilet, all it said was ew, comma, the toilet. <laughs> and me and Anna would use that to describe gross things all the time and be like, ew, the toilet. That's funny. <laughs> Ew. I told you that was gonna be gross. <laughs> I wanted to throw it out, but you were like, no, I'm gonna eat it. I'm still going to. I don't even warm it up, though. Why didn't you warm it up? Because that would stress me out. I hate tacos. At least when they're cold, they're a little bit firmer. <laughs> well, then why did you offer to take my leftover tacos? Because you were gonna throw them. it away, and I know I need to eat at some point, so I was like, oh, food. Yeah, but that doesn't mean you have to eat that food. Well, what else am I supposed to eat? Your food. The donuts that I bought? Yeah. For lunch? Yeah. That's pretty fucked. <laughs> I need to eat real food. Which is who cold says? tacos, I guess. <laughs> my my quitting body. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's who says. That's, that's fair. I have enough ammo. I don't know why I'm wasting time with trying to punch this guy and getting killed for it. Wait, but didn't you already defeat it? There's another one. How many? Boyd's got a lot of nightmares. There's only like two. Why isn't it target locking? You just made this today, right? Yeah. You know, actually it's pretty good. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Well, good. I'm glad you like it then. Shit. I need telekinesis. Is that that voice actor's genuine voice, you think? It's pretty close. Really? Yeah. I've met him before. I know. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I asked. <laughs> he was really nice. I wanted to get a recording of him doing the Raz voice, but um, the convention that he was at had rules against recordings, and he was really nice about it. I was like, it's alright if I take a video of you, and he was like, unfortunately, no, they won't let us do that. Mm -hmm. But he was, he was I like cool. when famous people are chill. Yeah. Oh, nice. I got an upgrade to my paunch. So this is literally just bean dip in a tortilla? Basically, yeah. That's so easy. Maybe I'll do that. Yeah. It's my, one of my shortcut meals. Because you can buy the pre-assembled bean dip. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. You see what I'm doing? You see what you're laying down? Yeah. And I picked it up. Yeah, you picked it, it in right my pocket. up. Pick it up. Ew. That fight in particular was kind of gross. <laughs> Just a minute. I thought she'd fucking died. There's a bunch of them. Oh. She's disposable. <laughs> There's millions! <laughs> They're unstoppable! Thank you, Rainbow Tourists. We knew you were. Won't you join us in our Rainbow Squirt? Pledge of purpose to promote niceness. To make the world prettier. To share candy with everyone. You're missing plot paying attention to your stupid taco. I can still hear. 
Yeah, but you're not watching the, the secret agents come creeping in. They're protecting the milkman. Yeah. Um, now they're secret guys for some reason. Yes. What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh. Whoa, did not like that. That was such a mom move. Catapults off her fucking whatever what are those things called? Ironing board? Yeah. I've always wondered if there's supposed to be another battle between you and the rainbow squirts there. Cause you just go straight in after the uh den mother. Wait, what do you mean that there, if there's supposed to be? If there was, wouldn't there be? Well, sometimes people run out of time and oh, they don't- Oh, you mean the writing? Run. Yeah. You have to fight the mom? Yup. She's got exploding cookie boxes that she's oh. chucking at me. Oh, mother. <laughs> no, mother. It's just the northern lights. It's just the northern lights. That was actually pretty good matching with the mouth. Yeah. Yep. So I take this thing that she's been holding, and I use clairvoyance on it. And now I can see in the dark. Mmm, smart. Yeah. It really makes it makes sure that you have opportunities to use all of these yeah. uh, abilities. Yeah. Start from the beginning. Oh, you donked up. I did. I donked up real bad. Almost as bad as when I corrupted the entire <laughs> save file and I had to start over from scratch. This is Still on the same level. Through that. <sighs> Made me so mad. <laughs> I was so oblivious to that rage. I had no idea you were mad. I was furious. I was just laughing at stupid videos. <laughs> Like, I love this game, but I don't want to have to speed through to get back to where I was so that we can play it and uh, get to Psychonauts 2. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm trying to get through yeah, this as fast so as possible. Without rushing. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. She does that a lot. She'll just charge right into the door. What the fuck are pets? <laughs> Great. How can he see in the dark? <laughs> Oops. Oh no. Oh, you fucked uh -oh. up. Uh -oh. Why'd you do that, Lumi? I... I thought you were supposed to stay on top. Yeah. I fucked up. Then why'd you go underneath it? Because I fucked up. <laughs> and I have to start over. So that's just great. <laughs> Everything's Maybe I should awesome. do it. No. <laughs> you don't know how to play this I game. I do. You I bet don't. I, I could beat it right away. First try. No. You spent ages getting to- God Why'd you keep jumping I... off? Shut I thought up. you were supposed to defeat her. <laughs> I know. So why did you shoot the woman? Because, why do you keep jumping off? It's so easy for her to win if you do that. I just felt like inconveniencing all of us and making things <laughs> take longer. And I want people to think that I'm actually bad at this game that I love oh, so very much. Oh, that makes much. sense. <laughs> we're doing a good job then. Yeah. I'm really giving it my all. <laughs> Ew. 
That's what pants are for. <laughs> yes, pluck out my eyeballs, whatever. Okay. God's eye? I guess what? that is what she says. That was weird, weirdly religious all of a sudden. <laughs> I should probably be using my shield. That's what I should be doing. Fine, I'll do it, okay? Get off my back. I thought you knew what to do. Yeah, well, it's been a while, right? <laughs> oh no! Uh, I thought we'd been over this. <laughs> I'm seething. <laughs> I never have that problem with this. I it's never. Because I'm being a dick. <laughs> yeah, you're getting me all worked up and <laughs> frustrated, making stupid mistakes well, that I'm I don't usually. Eating make. a taco. Yeah. Your taco. You have, <laughs> <laughs> you have no stakes in this. I really don't. I'm just enjoying the show. <laughs> Got my eyeballs. Clairvoyance. Alright. Got this. Shield. Boom. How can he see in the dark? That's so fucking funny to me. <laughs> Shield. Ah! No. I thought you were gonna use your shield. Yeah. I know. <laughs> okay, I already know. <laughs> And shoot! Oops! God damn it! I keep getting mixed up on the buttons. And I feel like a dagon fool. Dagon. <laughs> or maybe I'm just better than you. <laughs> Shield. Shoot. Come on, shoot. shoot. Oh. oh! Oh, this is so close. Shield. Okay. No. Don't Wait, but run. where is she? She's. Yeah, you have to go. Shield. Come on. Come on, come, come on. on! Shoot her! Oh. Okay. I got her. Wait, you did? Yes. Oh. That was so close. I know. <laughs> Woohoo! I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. Don't say that. <laughs> I don't like milk talk. Bloodbath out here. Milk is delicious. Special delivery today. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess he was a milkman. Yep. What off? <laughs> I'll never. Oh boy. I'll never look at Molotov cocktails the same after <laughs> watching The Good Place. Yeah, really. <laughs> I'm the milkman. My milk is delicious. What? Are you okay? Time for the final delivery to this address. Hey, is that milk regular kind? Or the exploding dream kind? It's fortified with what the world wants. <laughs> what the world deserves. Are you sure you don't want True. to talk about this, Boyd? <laughs> oh, I got a trophy. Time to deliver the milk. I don't know if trophies show up on the record or not. Oh, why wouldn't it? Oh, I don't know how the PS5 works. I don't know much of anything. 
I don't understand anything. <laughs> Oh, a brain! This is those old brains. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Don't do that shit. <laughs> yes, I got a brain. Finally, now your ears won't whistle so much when the wind blows. <laughs> ah, good one. <laughs> oh, I know what you meant. You and Sasha. No sense of humor when you're on a mission, hmm? Well, are you gonna come back here so we can recranialize that noodle while it's still al dente? Nah. I got other shit to do. What do you want us to do? Uh, go back and put the brain back in the child. Oh. Are we gonna do that at some point? Yeah. Don't worry, I'll put this one right next to kids. You know how my health is brains? Yeah. Oh, did you get an extra... Brain then? Well, when I put the brains back into the children, oh. then I get extra brains. Uh, good. I was worried you'd have to choose between an extra health bar and giving the brain back to its rightful owner. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be such a moral conundrum. I know. Oh my god, we get it. Your taco shell that won't cut. <laughs> Jesus. Having trouble with that taco there? Oh. Uh oh. Ew. Did you spill a little on yourself? Sure did. <laughs> well, get better at eating. <laughs> Thank you, all of you. You're all so kind. You make a girl That's so offsetting. Happy. We're off-putting. Excuse me, ma'am, but did you see a girl? You must be my new leading man. Aren't you handsome? But, my gracious, you're so young. Tell me why do they keep casting me with such mere babes? I guess that's the curse of having an eternally young face. Oh, you found my old trophy. I should really put that thing away before somebody hurts themselves on that clean metal claw-like part on the top. <laughs> Say, would you like to hear the story of how I won that award, dear boy? Are you trying to take it? Because you don't think I deserve it! No, no, you deserve it. I didn't take anything from you. I didn't ask to be famous. I just wanted you to love me. Hey! What? You're supposed to be dead! Who is this bitch? <laughs> She's one of the residents of the asylum. Which uh, we're in now, by the way. That okay. was the gate that the milkman had to open. Oh, right. Well, let's go see what's going on with this lady's brain, huh? So yeah, we're not- we're in the real world as of right now. Yes. But not for long. You don't like the performance. A simple boo will do. This part of the game is actually the only non-linear part because there's three different asylum residents and you can go into their brains in any order you want. But- Oh. I'm starting with her. Did we talk about it? <laughs> what do you mean? But what just happened is what I mean. Yeah, I farted. Real nasty. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Sometimes you gotta. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that while there was plot going on. <laughs> Not like you could pick and choose. Which is like living between a root canal and a sharp stick in the eye. Just ignore Jasper. He's just a critic. If he happens to be right, I'll go talk to the I'm sure all she needs is a little pep talk. That taco smells disgusting. <laughs> Are you sure that's not your fart? Yes. Was that on purpose? <laughs> Did you know I'd throw that back at you? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's your fart. No! The taco. <laughs> I can differentiate the smell between well, the Well, I didn't taco. notice a rank smell until a few seconds ago and I was like, oh, it's probably Lumi's fart. <laughs> and then a few seconds after I had that thought, you were like, that taco smells terrible. <laughs> <laughs> my farts don't smell like tacos. Well, that's what, that was my next one. I was like, Lumi's farts usually don't smell bad. 
<laughs> so what the fuck's going on? And then I didn't want to eat my taco until it passed. <laughs> oh, God. I'm so disgusting today. I'm super sweaty. I'm farting. It's just a bad time. <laughs> Being a human is just kind of gross sometimes. Yeah. I just, I spent so many years of my life being embarrassed about farts <laughs> and feeling like I wasn't allowed to laugh at them. And I'm a, farts are hilarious. I'm a fucking adult now. If I want to laugh at a fart, I will. Okay? <laughs> so get off my back. <laughs> Alright. I'm not gonna fuck around with the pigments Whoa. right now. I gotta talk to Bonita Soleil. Can you destroy that nativity scene? This? Yes. It's because just it's a bunch of props. <laughs> but yes, I can destroy them. Yeah! Destruction! That's what I like to see. What about that chair? I'm gonna leave the mushrooms. What about that chair? What about the oh, chair? Just destroy! Okay. Okay. There's Wait, there's a cobweb! Oh yeah, you're right. There's a sad little backpack behind it. <laughs> I don't have a suitcase tag, though. Why is it crying? <laughs> because it's emotional baggage. Oh, yeah. It's okay, I'll sneak into her dressing room by being invisible. That's a moral that seems thing moral. to do. Yeah. <laughs> Seems morally acceptable. <laughs> I like Bonita Soleil's design. Wait, let me see. Oh. She's very yellow. Yeah, she's she's the light. Mm. Excuse me, Miss Soleil. I heard you were feeling bad, so I just wanted to see that whatever you're going through, you're not alone. I used to be a performer myself, and I know how hard it is when can't you see I'm trying to have a moment here? <laughs> Sorry, I was looking for Bonita Soleil. You mean the personal muse of Gloria Von Guten, her inner sunshine? The spirit of her youth, yes. That's me. What do you want, an autograph? I'm kind of busy here. They need you on stage. Oh, right? wait, ask her who's crying. I, I can ask her that, too. Something? I'm drowning in a quagmire of self-pity. Why aren't you getting that? Should I be doing more with my hands? <laughs> so, you're not going out on stage? Have you seen any of the plays we put on here? Those god-awful slices of glorious, terrible life? How am I supposed to bring light to those? Listen, the burden of being the only sunshine in this theater is just too much for one beautiful, glowing, inspirational muse to bear, you know? Is there any way I can get you to take the stage for the fans? If you can get me some help out there, so I'm not the only light on the set. I'll turn on a spotlight. Uh, that could work. But you'll need a candle. Uh, I think there might be a spare in the storeroom. If you can get a candle into a spotlight and light it, I'll come Was this pretty controversial show, back then? Try. But I'm not promising um, anything. I don't know. I don't know if it was really big enough for there to be so much controversy. It was kind of a cold class. A Thanks. It's a recording. It helps me. <laughs> I'll leave you alone now. I know you have a lot to find. Thank you. Now where was I? <laughs> Don't leave me. I need Wawa. <laughs> you need Wawa? Yeah. Oh. Well, why don't you have your Wawa bottle here? I do. I drank it all. Oh. I'm really good at staying hydrated. Though. I'm not. I need to be better about that. It's a work in progress, you know. Everything is. Yeah. You know what I learned in therapy last session? Tell me. I well, first of all, my therapist showed me the cycle of. What did he, what's it really called? Of change, essentially, and it's like useful to a lot of drug addicts to look at it. And one of the stages in the change is relapse, 
Mm. And he told me that there's actually a lot of controversy using that word in the therapeutic world right now. They like to, there's a push to use, instead of relapse, use reoccurrence, I think is what he said. Mm. Because it's just literally a part of of having an ish, a problem. It's oh, part really? of having a problem is you're going to reoccurringly fall yeah. into it. And to have it be such an aggressive word like relapse yeah. is kind of discouraging. Saying yeah. it's kind of it kind of implies that you're starting all over. Yeah, like you That's failed. That's not true. Yeah, it's just a part of you. It's a part of change. That's... And you can apply it to anything. The reason he brought it up to me was like this is essentially for made for drug addicts. But we were talking about it in the sense of changing my sleep schedule because mm. I have been sleeping in lately. Yeah. Feeling like I fucked up and then started all over, falling back into bad habits is what I said that provoked him to show me that. Uh huh. Yeah, I thought it was cool. That's really cool. I like that framing of it a mm -hmm. lot better. Because I definitely get that kind of mindset. Like, I know, oh, I great, do too. I fucked up once now. Mm -hmm. I'm just doomed. Here, let me try to find the. Yeah. Do you want me to read you the six steps of it? Yeah, but first, let's uh, check out this memory vault real quick. Gloria's Cruel Training. Hygatha, home for girls. Who's that bitch? Wait, who is that bitch? She's a bitch. <laughs> we don't know who? She's she's the bitch who's training um, Gloria. I don't remember. Who's Gloria? Gloria is the lady who uh, we're in the mind of right now. She was the yeah, one the, was like, the you're supposed to be dead. Yes. Which one is she? The one driving away or the She's one the being dragged? Girl. Okay. Yeah, being dragged. Um. So she witch. was just put here in this asylum. When uh, she she's was not a in, kid. She's not in an asylum yet. She's in a place for like, she's in a home for girls, which is supposed oh, okay. to teach her how to like perform and do all this stuff. <clears throat> This bitch is very aggressive with the whip. And that's why her training was cruel. The end. So, tell me about the six steps oh, of I'm fucking up. I already forgot. Um, <laughs> it's called... Um, cycle change. I don't think it has a name. Okay. So there's no first step even. It's just a continuous circle slash spiral. Mm. It's just how it works with change. <clears throat> um, and it's not necessarily uh, linear, but this is the order that they typically have it go in. Uh -huh. The first quote, first unquote, is what the fuck? Oh, um, pre-contemplation, meaning no intention of changing the behavior. Mm. Next one is contemplation, aware a problem exists, but with no commitment to action. After that is preparation, intent on taking action to address the problem. And then next is action, which is active modification of behavior. And then maintenance, sustained change, new behavior replaces old. And then the controversial is relapse, slash what they want it to say is recurrence. Um, fall back into old patterns of behavior. And then the next one after that is pre-contemplation, no intention of changing behavior. Hmm. It just circles all back around. That's cool. Yeah. Lots happening now. She's playing Gloria. Mm hmm. Oh, or, no. She's. Something. I wasn't paying attention. Kid, if you want to 
to that'll knock them dead, I promise. Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Careful! That's the manual mood override. That's how we set the right mood for the play. Mess with that, and we'll have happy plays on sad sets, sad plays on happy sets. Total chaos. Or worse. <laughs> Someone hates so improv. <laughs> Some writer on this. Unless you want to see some strange stuff happen. I think Becky's not telling me the whole story. I should go give her a piece of my mind. All right. Do you wanna? Before we go get the new script and talk to Becky, Hopper. Oh. Good boy. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you want to do a new episode? Yeah. Okay. Alright, bye! Toodaloo!